crying doesn't indicate that you're weak. From birth, it always indicates that you're alive. Y'all, we got a rotisserie chick home. And some mixed vegetables. As a matter of fact, cue it. Y'all already know the vibes. Y'all already know the vibes. Ooh, oh, hold on. I'm about to get in it, ain't he? I'm about to get in it already. Hold on, let me get it. Let me get a thumb. Neasy thumbnail. All right, go ahead and get it. Go ahead and get that chick on. Y'all like in on it? Yeah, y'all got it. Y'all got it. I'm going with the harnacha today. I'm going with the harnacha today, y'all. Yes, sir. Ski. How y'all day been going? And I got a little rain. And I got a little rain, just a little bit of rain. How y'all day been going though? Get into these mid vegetables. Hmm. Yeah. How y'all day been going though? Oh. I'll tell you y'all. I'm going to become a chickacharian. I don't know if that's a real thing, but I love chicken. Really? Honestly? Just eat the gum. You're being honest. <clears throat> now, nah. if it was something I can just. I don't know what it'd be called. If I can just eat chicken. If I know I'm a vegetarian. Or. Vegan or not. Mmm. So y'all. Let everyone know. I told y'all. We not ready here. Hold on. Hold on, y'all. Let's turn the camera up a little bit. Hold on. All right, there we go. Y'all like that a lot better. I don't know, just one giving. I wasn't giving what I wanted to give. But, like I was saying, y'all, a lot of us <clears throat> over it.
Big Brother Heaven Hand, we just want to thank y'all. Especially the ones who been coming over sharing the video, and the Facebook and all that. Man, y'all be MVPs. Shout out to the ones. Who send the beautiful comments? To the one who donate. Let me say this now. When I got into this, right? When I got into this, right, I didn't really I didn't really know I didn't really know what I was getting myself into, honestly. But y'all It's so, ow. There's so many people out here, y'all, in the world. They just need love. I'm sure I know. There's really people out here, right? There's people. I've heard this. People pull up on. Somebody homeless. Ask them are they hungry. Do they want something to eat? And get them an empty box of chicken. An empty box an empty box of pizza. A bag of McDonald's with, with number trash in it. Like it's it's so heartbreaking to know that we got people out here that that that's that cold hearted to do that to another human being just because they down on their look at the moment. Or maybe it's just a misunderstanding because I don't understand it. But one thing I do know is that Jesus fed people. And I'm not saying Go out your way or do something that you can't afford to do. But just doing something mean and low down to somebody that's less fortunate than you at the moment, you're just cold blooded. In my opinion. You know, I guess until you actually out there yourself, it's kind of hard to understand it. I hear people say, I mean. God said, people literally just rolled by and just threw their trash out the window at them.
There's no way. I've actually, me and my organization have actually pulled up on people. Who told us that you can just throw it, just throw it. I know. I'm not gonna throw your food down like you're some kind of animal. So we'll get out and give it to him. Big brother heaven hand just don't get down like that. You know? Because I feel like if it was me or one of us out there. I do them the same way that I would want somebody to do me. I look at it like this. <sighs> I look at it like this. What if it was your mama out there? What, I'm just saying, what if it was your mom out there? Just genuinely how I look at it. So to me, everybody we pull up on, we family. I ain't gonna treat none of them no different. Now you have some people that's coming that's disrespectful, then that's different. I try my best to remain respectful, you know, at all times. But sometimes. It is necessary. Sometimes. You know. So. Sometimes. You gotta think about this. When you out there. Mm. You're dealing with all different types of people. All different types of people. Some of these people come from places you couldn't even imagine. We haven't been out there talking to people. Who were once millionaires. I asked this one guy. You know. He just seemed so smart. He seemed so smart. You know, I just wanted to know how he ended up in the situation he was in, if he felt comfortable telling me. And he said, he tried a drug. I didn't even say what drug, that old mouth.
But he tried this drug. And everything else went downhill after that. Yep. So you know the crazy part about that particular situation? He was like he got into a program and he don't even he's not even on the drugs anymore. But all his connections and people that he was in business with, even family members. I won't even deal with him anymore. Because of the way the situation went. People don't even want him around. You know, I guess because of some of the stuff he did, you know. But people got to understand that. I get it. Trust is hard to get back once you lose it. And you also gotta understand. And people on drugs, they're totally different people. Totally different people. This is true. I've seen a lot of people close to me. Lose a lot behind drugs, you know. Thank God some of them recover, but unfortunately, all of them don't. You gotta really, really want it, you know. But I guess sometimes you can just be so far gone that your mind don't even, you know, register certain things anymore. I'm guessing. You know? But shout out to all the people out there <clears throat> trying to handle this thing. Yeah, I'm trying to handle this thing. Trying anyway. I'm trying. I like this part of the. Oh, excuse me. I like this part of the chicken. Nobody eat out there with me, don't say nothing. Mixed it with a little rain. Mm hmm. Mixed it up real good. With that rain. Yeah. Yeah. And now you got you a concoction. Now you got you what you call a concoction. See? Look out. It's 
since I have started this organization, I've learned that there's a lot of people out here that need help. And there's a lot of people out here that's looking to take advantage of people who like to help people. And that, my friend, is sad. That's crazy. Because I really don't understand how people can try to scam people that's out here helping people. I've gotten whole emails and everything of people. Man, that they're homeless and need this, this, and that. I do some research on them. Are you taking chips and everything? I can live in your bed life. Mm. That's a man. It really is. Really is. Some pretty cold hearted people out here. I never understood it. But then again, everything is not meant for everybody to understand. I get it. You know? I said, Kay, okay, what you doing to the chicken? I'm sorry, the good meat at the bottom. Where I'm going? I know the chicken breaks up at the top, but sometimes. That may be a little too tough for me. So. I'll take man from the bottom. And then I leave the rest. Look, I cleaned it at the bottom, look. <coughs> I cleaned it at the bottom. But look at the top. I need everything from the bottom, though. That's crazy. This how I like mine. Now, come on, get me wrong. Sometimes we're getting the move on from the chicken breast part. 
But today, I just win the day. So take a look at me, I'm done! Yes, sir. Ski. Thank you, Lord. It was good. <clears throat> Y'all, I'm so sick of people asking me why I don't pray before I eat. Listen, my relationship with the Most High is just that. My relationship with Him. So, sometimes... You should just let people have their personal time with the Most High Lord, right? So every time I talk to them, I don't have to be on uh, uh, me? the camera. <sighs> but every time I see they coming, I know it got to be a new person. Because everybody that's been here already know what kind of person I am, what kind of relationship I got with the Lord. So, I love you and thank you so much. But I love you. When anybody tell you yesterday they love you, I love you. When anybody tell you the day before that, they love you, I love you. When anybody told you in 2023 they love you, can't eat. Love you. What time it is? Yeah. That's all I got. Ain't no more. Time is tight. That's the end of my show. So grab your hand, make a fist, listen to me, and remember this. I tell it to the hot. I tell it to the cold. I tell it to the young. I tell it to the old. I don't want no laughing. I don't want no crying. The most of all, no signifying. I love y'all. I'm going to eat out there. Eat, eat. Everybody else? We the gang. Y'all gang gang. We're not the same.